This isn't good, Nicholas. Where is the freezer, man? I, I know as much as you do, okay? I don't know why you're asking me. Look, maybe the staff must have moved it, okay? But why? We'll dissect motivation later, after we find the freezer. There's a body inside there. If someone opens it up, we're as dead as Ted. At least we thought the lock it. Yeah, and it's gonna take somebody a whole three minutes to pry open the lid. You're right, this can't happen. Come on. When I give an order, I expect it to be carried out. Sir, I can see you're very upset that I'm not quite sure why. The freezer why. that was here? Yes. I thought that I made it clear that it was not to be disturbed. But, sir, before you mentioned it, I already had arrangements to have it moved and opened up by the by the locksmith. I, I see now I should have uh, reported it to you when the subject came up, but I thought I'd have time to to change my orders. You, you didn't have any time? The lock's been removed. Well, well no, I'm expecting uh, some workmen here. I forbid it! That freezer belonged to my uncle, and he left it here for whatever reason, and here is where it is going to stay. And I don't give a damn what locksmith or staff member is inconvenienced. I want that freezer back here, right now, lock intact. Am I clear enough this time? I'll take care of it right away, sir. Thank you. I forgot how obnoxious and overbearing you can be when you wear your cassette on Yeah, well, uh, I haven't put it on in a while. It still fits. Uh, <laughs> Way to go, old princely one. Get up. <laughs> well, we, uh... We lucked out. The lock hasn't been forced or touched, as far as I can see. We still have to open the freezer. Mm. Look, I just told you the lock hasn't been tampered with. Let me break this down for you. Whoever was clever enough to murder this guy and set up Emily to take the fall, if that someone figures out that this body mysteriously vanished and they connect the dots back to Windermere, this measly little lock is not enough to keep them from stealing him back. All right, well, look, let's hope that didn't happen again because the next logical step for the killer to take is to make sure that we disappear too. So. Go ahead, old streetwise one. Uh, he's still there, all right. You, you do realize what we're doing is completely insane. We cannot keep this guy on ice much longer. Yeah, that's a good one. On ice. <laughs> I wasn't joking. I know. But before we can get rid of this Ted guy, we gotta figure out who he is. And why no one seems to be bothered much that he went to a rave and never came back. Hey, I got your message. What's hey, up? Hey, um, you guys, this is turning into a major nightmare and it's not getting any better. Look, we've already lost five grand. I think we should just go to the cops after no, all. No, no, absolutely not. The reasons that we decided not to still stand. I think Emily's yeah. onto something. What since when? You and I are going to go down to the PCPD tomorrow. To turn ourselves in? No. We're going to do a little investigation to our boy Ted. See if we can find out why no one's missed him. 